What is good, Skins fans? So uh, we just franchise tag Brandon Sheriff, which I told you guys we were expected to do that a few weeks ago. I reported by Jenna Lane. This one was reported, I want to say, by Ian Rappaport or Dan Graz, and it was one of those guys um, reported this. So Brandon Sheriff will be making, uh, I want to say, about fifteen and a half million or something like that. I know Brandon Brooks is the highest paid guard in the league, so I know when they franchise tag uh, Brandon, he will be uh, around that whatever the highest guard is getting paid, which is fourteen, fifteen mil per year. So um, we haven't got a long-term deal done yet. I'm hoping we can get that done um, before the season starts so we can just extend to Brandon Sheriff and um, keep him locked up for a long time. He's, been a, he's a three-time Pro Bowler, was what, the fifth pick of the draft? I think we picked him at fifth. He used to be a left tackle or a right tackle, and then we moved him to the guard position. And uh, he's really been great at that position. He's been really, really darn good at that position. So, um, you know, so he's been really, really good. Um, playing right guard for us and um, then we can lock up Eric Flowers I'm hoping right now so him getting 14 13 mil, 14 15 mil a year that will put him down from um, our salary cap right now I think we have about 63 million available after cutting Josh Norman and cutting Paul Richardson about 63 mil so that will probably bring us down to about you know 49 48 million uh, dollars uh, 48 million dollars in cap space will be available to start off with free agency. Now I'm hoping we can trade Trent and free up about $10 million in cap space. If we just trade, trade him for a second round pick or two thirds, we can gain $10 million in cap space. That would be a huge, huge, huge help. Um, the offensive line, like I said, bring back Eric Flowers and um, Brandon Sheriff for a long-term deal. Um, and then we have at center, Chase Ruye. And then we just got to find a left tackle. I don't know who it's going to be, whether we're going to draft one or um, there's been a lot of sources saying maybe Jack Conklin, even though he really plays right tackle, um, we could try to bring him in and maybe confront him to the left. I'm not so sure about that one. There's some other left tackle, a lot of people saying Jason Peters from the Eagles. So there's some options, not great options, but there are some options out there for left tackle. Um, so it looks like we probably will have to draft or, or um, uh, get Jason Peters possibly. We'll see about that one. Um, but I'm happy we're keeping Brandon Sheriff. I wish it was a long-term deal already done, but like I said, we'll just – Hopefully, Ron Rivera can get that done before the season starts in September. Um, let me, you guys, let me know what you guys think about that deal. Uh, once again, everybody, stay safe and wash your hands, man. It was cool meeting my guy uh, Redskins review. Make sure you guys sub to his channel. Um, it was cool meeting him yesterday. It was real cool. Make sure you check out my community tab. I put up the picture uh, of me meeting him there. It was real cool, real cool guy, real cool dude, man. Uh, shout out to Redskins review. All right, y'all. Hail to them skins. All right, y'all. Peace. Oh, one last thing. They said they might postpone free agency as well um, because of all the things going on. I would not be a happy guy if they did that. I'm, I'm, I'm really – I would not be a happy guy. I really wouldn't. You know, I understand the safety first, but, you know, I feel like they can still sign contracts. They got video. They got FaceTime, Skype, uh, Uvu, whatever app you want to use. They can still sign these contracts. I don't know if they do physicals and things like that, but they can they can do a physical – you know, I don't know. If, I don't think. I don't know if you can do a physical over the phone. Or, I mean, via Skype or FaceTime or something like that. But honestly, man, these big time free agents, man, they they know their physical is fine if they want to sign them and do things like that. I, I think they should continue the league year. Honestly, um, you know, I, playing games. No, they shouldn't be playing games, of course. But I think they can continue signing contracts and picking teams. You know, if they, if they do that, you know, I understand why they make the decision. I would still be upset. I mean, my goodness, and you know, no basketball, no football. And they can't even have free agency. My goodness gracious. But it, I understand, like I said, safety first. But it's, it's just crazy, man. It really is. All right, y'all. Hail to them skins. Be safe out there. All right, y'all. Peace.